Yeah, and also he was a loser who who got lucky uh, by wandering into uh, Haight Ashbury in San Francisco at a time when there was a, a horde of young people who whose brains had been kind of rearranged on drugs, and they were looking for someone to give them direction and meaning. And he was he had a real gift for manipulation, um, and he he was all too happy to be that person. When I was directing Matt, I said, you know, all the footage, almost all the footage that's available are, is stuff of him after the murders, after the trial, when he's performing for the camera. Manipulating the media. Yes. Yeah. It's a performance of him being all wild and crazy. So don't take that as your sort of template for the performance. We've got to find the person he was before those uh, camera performances. Yeah, the closest thing that we get to a sort of classic Charlie moment is when Hannah first, Hannah's character first meets him and he does the kind of like mirror me, but from then on out, he's just a straight up abusive, hus manipulative husband manipulating these women. Yeah, because I mean, it's called the family and it's, an, you know, it's kind of a classic uh, abusive family where everyone sort of supports each other and tries to turn a blind eye to the abuse. And, and what he says goes, and all his crazy arbitrary rules, and everyone's just almost like complicit in their own abuse a bit. Mm -hmm.